de de hey Don. So you clicked on this one. Cause something hurts downstairs, like your butt. <laughs> your butt, your fanny, is hurting you, and you want to know about an aftermarket saddle, and I don't blame you. I understand. I'm here to help you. Dr. Bart. I'm a fanny expert. In more ways, never mind. Look out now. All right, here we go. So, is it your butt that hurts? Well, we'll get into that in a little bit. We're going to start her off with a whole, we got a whole bunch of different saddles that we're going to, come on in here, Mr. Cameron Guy. Let me show you an introductory of all of our saddles. We got five different saddles we're showing you here today. All made by Surface. Cruiser E-Gel with a hole in the middle. Women's see-through E-Gel uh, air lift. This one's kind of neat. You hit it with air. And a Cruiser Classic. Bag up. Yes, all sir. Of these, <laughs> all of these saddles will should and should easily go onto your bike, and we'll explain that, that explain that to you momentarily. For now, let's go to the one that you clicked on. Hi guys, bike man for you instructional video. Working on the butt kiss. So your butt hurts. Well, I understand. I don't understand for the women, but I understand for the guys. But, you know, in all, we're all kind of in the same boat. It hurts downstairs, all right? The women's see-through saddle, the holy saddle. No, it's not a religious saddle. But you will believe in God after you sit on this thing because it will be sitting on a cloud, all right? Much better than your old one, all right? What's the matter with your old one? Your old one might have a construction like this, all plastic underneath, hard, okay? There's nothing underneath on this baby. You got that clean air breeze following you right through. As well as, as you can see, it's, it's soft where the points of your pelvis are. It's gel. With a light recovering over the top, reflective trim, a good all-around women's saddle. Works phenomenal. Uh, what am I missing? What am I missing? Oh, size, size, size. What do they say it is? They say it's size 10 inches long by 7 inches wide. It's 10 inches this way, 7 this way. Let's see if they're right. Right on the money. 10 inches to the black. And yeah, they might be a little shy there. I'll go 6 and 3 quarters in width. But they're close. 10 by 7, 6 and 3 quarter. Yeah, all right. Women's see-through holy saddle. You're sitting on a cloud. Never fear. The Bike Man for You is here. <laughs> How you guys doing? Bike Man for You instructional video. Two different flavors of seat post clamp. Let me show you. You got the old school style and new school style that has a clamp and this fits onto here like this. Then the other style is that the clamp is all integrated into the actual post itself. Let's go to this side first. style first. This comes on and off, off, and this comes out, and then you would just pry this out like that. Clamp, seat clamp. Coming off of your old seat, put it onto your new seat. One side, hold that side to there, this side here, and then roll it in. And you get it to this point here, make sure that she's kind of lined up good. You give it a good, it gets a little tight. Ooh, and she click right in there. You notice that? Post, bolt goes through there. This goes through there. Oops. There we go. Even amount of smush factor on each side. Let's go over here to the post. Oop, I didn't do the post. Post goes in there. Don't let go of your post. Goes down the hole and you can't get it back. All right. This goes on to here, right? Slips right in the hole towards the front of the bike. Now, you might not need a seat at all. Maybe you need to adjust your existing saddle. The all saddles go up and down and go fore and aft. A little bit, fore and aft. A lot up and down. So you might, one click, one way or the other, could make the difference between ooh and ah. Just letting you know. Okay? Bike man, would you explain to us where the ooh 
is and the ah uh might be as as far as that as saddle. A, uh, is it the horizontal of the saddle? Could you go into that a little bit for us? Usually you start with this baby being level to the ground. That's where I was going. Okay, and then sometimes a little click down, maybe you relieve the pressure, or some people feel like it's sliding off and they want it to go up, up a notch. So there's a fine line here. And you have to find that for yourself. Okay? Standard, old school clamp. This has uh, ratchets in it. Blah, blah, blah. Now, next. Integrated clamp on the post. is usually a 6 millimeter Allen key right there. Okay? Little more difficult. Nah, I shouldn't say that. It's a little bit... It's different. Yeah, it is. It's just different. It's not more difficult. We're probably used to more used to the old school bike, man, <laughs> being old timers that you are. Oh, yeah. All right, here we go. With these, if you hold this, slide that to the side, you see that? Loosen it up just enough to be able to that you don't have to deal with it. You don't have to undo the bolt, okay? Loosen it up just enough, put it horizontal. Now, the bolt goes to the back, not to the front. Bolt to the back. You threw a curve there, Sorry. bike man. Bolt to the back, not this way. The seat will be constantly pointing up if you put it that way. Always the bolt to the back. Okay? And again, putting it on sideways, then turning this, holding it up, and then clamping it down. Let's go back over to the bike itself so I can show you what's going on with this one. Let me get that old school post out of there. So now you know how to adjust both, both styles. Again, you know, I can go up and down. This style happens to be a little bit more of a micro adjust up and down. Okay? And again, we start with it level, and I, I can go fore and aft on this too. Start it in the middle, put it level, and that's where you control your starting point is. That's the default setting, <laughs> yeah, Mr. Yeah. Bike Man. That's it. So there you have it. You got to make sure she's nice and tight before you go off and you ride. And there you have it. Both types of seat posts. I want you to never fear. The bike man for you is here.